Hi, my name is Clement Bukuru. I'm one of the instructors that will be taking on the Diamond Cube Aspen High Six online training. Today we'll be getting on the first module, which is a propane refrigeration loop. The word refrigeration is used in the context of cooling, freezing. It is a very common principle that is seen everywhere around us. This principle is common to the natural gas processing and petroleum refining industry. Where refrigeration is used to cool gas to meet high carbon dew point specification and to produce a marketable liquid. In this model, you will construct, run, analyze, manipulate a propane refrigeration loop simulation. You will convert the complete simulation to a template, making it available to connect to other simulation. Once you have completed the section, you will be able to add connect operations to build the flow sheet, use the graphical interface to manipulate the flow sheet in ISIS, understand the forward backward propagation of information in ISIS, and convert simulation cases to templates. For the purpose of this course, we'll be working on the simple refrigeration cycle. Our aim is to produce a gas with a given dew point specification. Here, when we talk about dew point, we mean a state whereby the vapor becomes saturated and liquid begins to form. At a state, the vapor fraction of the gas equals 1. The simple refrigeration cycle, as seen here, features four basic unit operations the JT valve, the chiller, the compressor, and the condenser. Stream 1 enters at a temperature at 15 degrees Celsius passed through a JT valve. The JT valve in this operation serves an optimization tool which we were able to use to reduce considerably the duty of the chiller here that would have been required to affect proposed temperature drop we need to meet up with a given dew point specification at stream 3. The analysis of the JT valve will seem much clearer when we complete our simulation case. Stream 2 enters the chiller and is further cooled. Our aim here actually is to meet up with the given dew point specification at point 3. The chiller cools the gas bringing it to dew point specification at point 3. At this point, it does not need to do much work again as the JT valve has helped in reducing the temperature of the gas. Hence, we can save energy that would have been used to power a much bigger chiller that wouldn't be needed to get the job done. Sim 3 here enters the compressor where the compressor boosts its pressure with an efficiency of 75% bringing the gas to a dew point and a vapor fraction of 1 at stream 4. Finally, the existing stream from the compressor talking about stream 4 enters the condenser which is the last unit operation in the propane revision cycle. It condenses the saturated gas at the bubble point into liquid and allows the remaining gas to go through the process again forming the cycle.